Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is Robbie with Technobred Gaming, and I have got a Dead Space 3 tutorial video here. This is how to get past the Snow Beast Spider Boss in Chapter 9 of Dead Space 3. Now, this is probably the, the first, you know, real significant boss fight you're going to see in this game. And uh, it's a lot of fun, uh, but it can be a little challenging. I'm uh, playing on hard difficulty, and it definitely took me, you know, a couple, a couple of tries to, to figure out how to get past this guy. Now, I have a few tips for you. First of all, you're going to hopefully have enough... Uh, enough of an inventory that you're gonna you know you're gonna want to have a couple of health packs a couple of ammo packs and uh, preferably a couple of stasis recharges um, because you'll see this guy is gonna make these lunging motions and a lot of the time he'll hang back and you can just kind of wail away on him but when he lunges at you it's uh it's awesome if you have a stasis pack you can freeze him in place and run away and kind of kite him around um, if you don't, he's, you can see he took out a pretty significant chunk of my life there, so I'd use a health pack to get back, get back close to full. Now, there's this rock structure you see me running around there. I found that to be pretty useful. Uh, I was kiting him around using that rock and kind of keeping my distance. But the whole time I'm shooting, you'll notice I'm kind of running backwards and just keeping him at a, at a max distance there. As far as the actual tactics of the fight, those are the, the best suggestions I have. You know, um, kite him the whole time, running backwards, and use that rock for cover if you can to try and avoid those lunges. When he lunges, if you can get him with a stasis like I did there, that's awesome. If not, make sure you have a couple health packs to recharge. And Like I'm doing here, don't be afraid just to, to turn around and sprint away at full speed. Uh, get a little distance when things start getting hairy. Now, a couple of tips if you're really stuck on this guy, there's a few things you can do. Like I was saying, it really helps to have a you know, stockpile of health packs and ammo packs. If you don't have those, you can always you know, exit out of the game and start the chapter over. And you know, find an engineering bench, whip up some, some health packs, ammo packs, stasis packs, make sure your gun is upgraded fully, and uh, you know, get, your, get your gear ready before you go into the boss fight. The other thing you can do if you're you know, really frustrated or not really into the challenge of, of these bosses is, you know, you can always hit escape and, uh, you know, start over, or excuse me, not start over, but change your difficulty. You know, go to, go to medium or easy, just get past the boss and then bump it back up to what you were having fun with before. Because, you know, it's really no fun being stuck in a game where you can't get past, uh, even though that might be kind of frowned upon by some. Now, at this point, I'm out of ammo. I'm not really sure <laughs> what I should do. I'm, you see, I tried to hit him there, but I remember there's this nice stockpile of ammo clips uh, towards the, you know, kind of things. if you're looking at it, it's on the right side of that building. So I was able to go and grab a bunch more ammo, and luckily it was enough to, to finish them off. So we're getting towards the end of the fight. You'll see he grows these tentacles periodically, and you can shoot them off. There, they're coming out right now. And uh, if you aim for the kind of yellow joints that fall off, like you did right there, I would assume this has some kind of significant meaning for the fight. Um, although I'm, I'm frankly not sure. It's getting a little hairy here. You can see, uh, thank goodness I had another health pack, but I keep wailing away on him, wailing away on him. As I'm watching it here, I bet those, those tentacles are the key to beating the boss. You gotta knock those off. Maybe, you know, a set number of times to get past him. Maybe all the shooting at his body I was doing isn't actually doing anything, but... This guy, there we go, finally runs away. If you ask me, that probably means we'll see him again, but there you have it. That is how to beat the snow monster boss in Chapter 9 of Dead Space 3. Thanks so much for watching, everybody.